Sam. Let's talk about the two different types of saddles that you create for guitars when you replace them. I create, I carve non-compensated and compensated saddles. So tell us about the non-compensated. Non-compensated saddle, this is one I have removed, is typical that you find on most acoustic guitars. It's smooth, it's uniform, and that's about what it looks like. It's straight, it's smooth. Okay, and what about the compensated saddle? Compensated saddles have a staggered top see them there and it allows you to put the string into uh, a better intonation with the guitar and the size of the string so it has different break points it has different rather break than points. the non-compensated yes yeah, so it's carved into it yes okay and what do you make those out of again i make these out of bleached cow bone okay so the same material that you use when you build a nut it is Okay, so is there an advantage of one over the other? If you, someone brings their guitar in and they need a new bridge, do you recommend one over the other? I, I recommend a compensated. Sometimes you can't do a whole lot of a compensated saddle depending on the thickness of the saddle. But the thicker the saddle, you're usually better off a lot of musicians like to experiment with different size strings and especially if they're heavier than what has come on and what that guitar was designed for. The compensated will compensate for the difference in the thickness of the strings giving you a little bit better intonation. So that's what you recommend usually when you replace uh, one? I, you, yes. Okay, very good. Thanks for your time today. Sure.